So what have you think? What have you thought so far? Did you like the divers? Mm -hmm. Was mm -hmm. the air sprayer pretty fun? Mm -hmm. Were you able to get it after we turned off the camera? Mm -hmm. Is it pretty easy? Mm -hmm. What were some tricks? You had to keep the strut a little far from the other strut. Like so just the strut is a little bit back behind. Like this. And it would spray good. Okay. Now when we think of water, a lot of people think of playing and having fun, which is okay. So for this experiment, we're going to try to make a water cannon. But we're going to use some water pressure first. So the things we need, I have a two liter bottle with a balloon. with a balloon on top. Now what I've done is I've actually made a little hole in the side. I had to use some tools, so make sure that you do this only with mommy or daddy watching. So I have made a little hole in the side. What do you think the hole is there for? There? Yep, it lets yeah. air go in and out. I also have some tape. Tape. This is duct tape. Duct. Duct. I have a bucket with water. water. Okay. And this we're just gonna you know, get some water out and pour it in and shoot it out. And this funnel is just to help us draw out the water. So, first of all, we're gonna take this little balloon and see if we can get it to go inside. inside. I think just I need somebody with little fingers to do that. Me? Do you think you can get it? Yeah. Okay, David, can you push it in the rest of the way? Good. Okay, now what would happen if I tried to blow this balloon up? What, what do you think would happen? It would get bigger. It would get bigger, but I'm going to do a little trick first. I'm going to take a bit of this tape. Duct tape. And I'm going to cover the hole. With the hole covered, what do you think will happen? No air will go in and out. Yep, the air won't be able to get out. So will the balloon get very big? Do you think it'll still fill it up? Let's find out, shall we? Yes! So I'm going to take this, and I'm going to try to blow. <gasps> oh, I really can't do it. Let me try again. <gasps> oh, that's embarrassing. I can't get anything. So let's see what happens. Davis can. David Maybe, can. but I might have some germs, so we'll try again with a different no, balloon. No, no, probably be... What I'm going to do is I'm going to uncover the it's hole. It's because the, uh, the hole is covered. That's right. So there was no, the, the pressure was too great inside for the balloon to get bigger. So now I'm going to try again. Ready? <gasps> Whew, what happened there? <laughs> it stayed. Okay. It stayed big, but it kind of collapsed the sides. Can can we put water in it now? If we put water in it, what do you think will happen? It'll explode. If we put water in it, hey, we can the water will probably just stay. Like, yeah. And since <laughs> I don't really want to get the ceilings wet, do you? Uh, no. Maybe we, we should finish the rest of this experiment outside. So we'll pause for just a minute and we'll go outside. And put shoes on. Right, shoes on. <laughs> okay, so here we are outside. We just moved our little table outside. David, what was your question you asked on the way out? How did... How did we get the balloon to stay big without covering the hole? Yeah, we didn't cover the hole. It's just wide open. What do you think happened? Uh, so you remember, know. the hole on the side of the bottle was uncovered. I blew it up. <gasps> the balloon got bigger because air could go out. Then I covered the hole boom, with the tape. So now no air can get in, so the balloon stayed big. If I were to take the tape, I'll just show you. If I were to peel this tape off a bit, watch what's going to happen to the balloon. It's going to get small. Can you peel it off? See how it got smaller? Now can you blow it back up? Mm-hmm, I sure can. Oops, I need to un uncover it. So again, the, the hole is is uncovered on the side and it's there's nothing here. <laughs> it's extra small now. Ready? <laughs> hmm, Did I, I got it bigger before. Let me try again. You want it to be very big. Okay, ready? <gasps> Is that okay? Yeah, I Probably could have been bigger, but it's all right. Okay, so now I told you this is a water cannon. Since we're going to be playing with water, it's kind of like playing with a water gun. You don't point it at anyone unless they want to get wet. So I put the funnel in here. Filled this up with some water. I'm going to pour it in. 
you tell where the water is? Yeah. Uh, yes. Is it I the think top it's yet? Full. No. no. It's not at the Do top. Should we put some more? Yeah. I'll tell you what it is. Oh, that's probably enough. Yeah. Okay, so now there's the air is trapped inside the bottle. There's water in the balloon. What'll happen when I un uncover this? It'll shoot out the water. Okay, children, can you come stand over here? And I'm going to just point this this way a little bit. It's not pointed at anyone. I'm going to uncover and let's see what happens. Ready? There it goes. Didn't really shoot out as much as we would have hoped, but let's try again, shall we? I, I, I thought it was going to go like... Maybe if I had a bigger balloon. Let me try again. I wanted to get wet. Is that okay? Yeah. Maybe if we use a little less water. Rebecca, can you come over here? It'll go like this. We'll just pour a little bit of water in. Mo, mo. No, now it's just going to go like this. We'll see. Ready? <gasps> Let's do a countdown from three. One, three, one, two, two one. one. <sighs> oh, not so much. Maybe it's because the bottle is kind of thin and it's collapsing. But is this pretty fun? Yes. Yeah. How about we just put water in it and then blow it up? Put water in it and then blow it up? Uh-huh. We could do that. But I think this is enough science for right now, don't you? So what did we do today? Did you have any fun? We yes. did. We did three experiments. We did the Cartesian divers. Oh. Where we, we squeezed and the packets went down. Way. We just did three, Rebecca. You squeeze and the packet goes down. Is it going to come back up? There it goes. We did the, the water sprayer. And this one we did the water cannon. Not much of a cannon, but it was fun anyway. All, the, all three of these experiments demonstrated what scientific principle? It starts pressure. with pressure. Good job. Just remember, if someone says no pressure, they don't really mean it. <laughs> There's pressure everywhere. Science is fun, isn't it? Yeah. Say goodbye. Bye, guys.